In this week's video, I show you where Peter Mayhew, the man who portrayed Star Wars' beloved Chewbacca character, is buried. But first, my name is Tui Snyder. I write books, and I give talks, and I do a lot of research. And I love finding fun stuff and sharing it with others. So please, take a moment to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. Okay, today I'm going to take you to Peter Mayhew's grave. Mayhew is the actor who portrayed Han Solo's Wookiee sidekick, Chewbacca, in the original Star Wars trilogy. Although born and raised in England, Peter Mayhew married a Texan gal and moved to the Lone Star State. Sadly, Mayhew died of a heart attack on April 30th, 2019 at his home in Boyd, Texas, and was buried in nearby Azalan Memorial Park and Mausoleum. I put a blue dot on this Texas-shaped waffle to give you a general idea of where Boyd and Azaland Memorial Park are situated in North Texas. And I waited a couple weeks after Peter Mayhew's burial to visit the cemetery. I'm a Star Wars fan, but I didn't want to disturb his family or close friends. Azaland is a modern cemetery, but it's quite pretty. There are statues of the angel Gabriel blowing his horn as you enter. And they've got this antique horse-drawn hearse donated by Weatherford Truck Sales. I especially love this grotto, with Jesus beckoning from above. As you can see, the stone has rolled away from the entrance. When we got there, I wandered around, and I could not find where Peter Mayhew was buried. For one thing, I got distracted. I admit it. I love cemeteries. To me, they are full of stories and history. Like this guy, a World War II veteran missing in action. And of course, suddenly I heard my husband calling. He had stayed on task, and he found the groundskeepers. They were really nice. Not only did they tell us about Peter Mayhew's grave, but they told us about Cecily Conkling, who was a Barnum & Bailey clown. She died in a tragic circus train wreck. And they showed us this guy, Frank Fayette Jr., an accomplished bassist who played with Jimi Hendrix at Woodstock. They also revealed that Azaland's Grotto was originally part of a movie set. Speaking of movies, you're here to see Peter Mayhew's grave. And it is way back in the corner of Azaland. I mean way back. It's not that grave in front. It's the one back by the woods. You can just barely see it right by that bouquet. Okay, here's a much closer look. As you can see, right now, it's not fancy. Just some flowers and a tiny little photo of Peter Mayhew and Chewbacca. I really doubt that cookie is still there. We've had a lot of rain since I visited. By the way, when people leave things at a burial site, like coins, stones, cookies, toys, and so on, it's called grave goods. Have you ever seen grave goods at a burial site or maybe left any yourself? If so, tell me in the com comments below. I'd really like to hear. Peter Mayhew's family has ordered a custom-made headstone, but it won't be placed for quite a while. So I'll post another video when that happens. In the meantime, if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. I post a new video each week, but if you want more content right now, you can always drop by my website or read one of my books. Thanks again, and I'll see you next week.